Hola guys! Hola, welcome to Buenos Aires. We live yeah. here around one oh, month. Yeah. That's our first vlog from Buenos Aires, and we're gonna tell you about price for apartments, how to find apartments but Airbnb because it's quite expensive in Airbnb right now, but it's a lot of ways you could find it way cheaper. We're gonna show you a little bit of the city and our apartment, and we're gonna tell you how much we pay for that. Yeah, look at yeah, this building. And yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> what you wanted to say? Yeah, and uh, that we will live here like a long time. And uh, if you want to know more about Buenos Aires, about Argentina, just follow That's our a boop, boop. channel. Yeah, they have a lot of shit here because they really love dogs. <laughs> and don't love to clean after their dogs. Yeah, sometimes. Cute fact we noticed about the Buenos Aires city that they actually have really beautiful doors like this door and this and this door and they just have tons of beautiful doors and we spoke with our landlord Sandra she's owner of apartment we rent and the uh, Argentinian people they just don't notice that they have super beautiful doors in the city that's what I told you about the doors like look at the door this one and that one also like you cannot see it after the car, but it's still pretty beautiful. We haven't been in a lot of neighborhoods yet, but for now this one, not exactly this street, but uh, this neighbor, it's one of our favorite place in Buenos Aires because look at this side, it's so many green trees and it's winter right now. So a lot of trees not green, like for example, this. Look at here, this is tangerine trees and that's alley of tangerine trees. I, I don't think anybody can hear what you're saying. Oh uh, yeah, again, beautiful <laughs> door. It's what we're talking about and uh, I love it. Oh. That's really cute. We could try. No, no. <laughs> Prices. So uh, one dollar is 320 peso and one kilo of orange costs like 89 peso so basically it's like 30 cents yeah, or something, something about. Our home is there, it's there. Just go straight. But our place it's uh, not so beautiful like here. But we need only like 10 minutes and we are here. Let's go? Yeah, let's go. This is we have small hallway in the apartments and it's a place you can keep all your stuff. This is our bathroom and I really like that we actually have a bath there, but it's really messy. So, are you going? <laughs> and this is our living room and it's actually a studio, so it's living room and after the closet uh, slash wall, our bedroom. And I really like that we have it here because it uh, makes it more like not studio, so we have some separated places. We have a huge, huge, turn around, turn around, <laughs> huge closet and it's like looking me in a closet it's really huge and it's like whole wall and we don't have so many stuff in our apartments would you talk something else i want to say about the owner of apartments she make present for us make yeah and this uh, like i don't know how can i call it it's this like is a perfume, perfume but it's part perfume, solid perfume so you use it like that and this is so cute because she didn't know who we are. She just decided that like it's in some guys who came to Buenos Aires uh, who gonna rent her apartments and they have to make presents for us. So this is really, really cute. It's not only okay. one present from her. She also gave us uh, some things for mate. Mate is Argentinian uh, tea and this is uh, tiny calabasa so you could go anywhere to the park while you go into the cafe while you go into anywhere you can make matter for yourself so this is a box it's really huge box for matte leaves 
and this is small kalabasa. Uh, we we have, also have a straw. Yeah, we have it's one like more. special straw for mate. This is our kitchen. Welcome. She also gave us this. This is big kalabasa for mate. That's her name. So she didn't present it to us because it was present for her, but she gave this to us for some time. And this is a straw, special straw for mate. It has this thing, I don't know how you call it in English. So when you drink, you wouldn't drink also leaves because it's a lot of matte leaves in the drink when you make matte. Yeah, and, uh, look, and look at this, they yeah. have like special option in the pot for matte. And when we check in, uh, uh, we already had here matte. Yeah, because she also leave it for us here and she left some tea for us some local candies, traditional candies, that was really cute. And we have everything here, what we need. We have pot, toaster, coffee machine, I don't know. We have microwave. Oven. And we have microwave. And, and we have a small garden in our terrace. In balcony. And you can like sit here and spend some time. It's a lot of plants. We already told you before that Argentinian people really love plants. When it's gonna be summer, it's uh, all these streets are gonna be green because it's you can see it's a lot of trees here yeah and this so one it's also and it's yeah and this nice. street and this is already pretty green and no, yeah i mean that but this street so the green it's so near with us i will sit here drink coffee it's here Mate. with the green Mate, <laughs> maybe yeah and uh, actually we have here something like yeah we uh, have like place where we can find fruit Leh, focus wait a moment yeah uh, you can see fruit market here and this is a supermarket where you can find anything you need and there is one more fruit market after the tree that's hard to yeah, see and cafeteria is there and uh, i like it because you can just spend i don't know two minutes and uh, cafeteria yeah cafeteria it's like i don't know a place where you can buy something bakery <laughs> it's bakery why cafeteria because it's named cafeteria. <laughs> because it's Spanish. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> yeah, and our favorite coffee place, like few blocks there and few blocks there. So it's like five minutes from here and we're gonna go with you there later. We yeah, we have three kilo naranja. Uh, naranja? Na naranja. <laughs> That's orange in Spanish. We try to learn Spanish because it's really necessary here. And uh, I spent this for costs this like, like 60 cents for three kilo. Yeah, or like 60 like cents this. US dollars for three kilo of orange. It, it this is super cheap. This is our bedroom space. I really want to paint some picture and replace this small one because it's I don't know it's like so huge wall and so small painting yeah, this is a lot of a lot of plants in the apartments and this is small plants so we already told you that Argentinian people really love home plants and this is super nice because it's so cozy and so nice uh, we have a heater because it's winter in Argentina right now because it's under the equator so it's mid July it's not July it's August now and this is like the mid of winter and it's about plus 10 plus 15 degree mostly outside but we used to live in really warm apartments because in after USSR countries it's usually really warm in the apartments and it's super freezing for us like european winter when it's cold outside and inside and it's about like plus 15 plus 18 degree in the apartments that's just that's freezing we couldn't live in these conditions so we use heater it's not enough for apartments because it's about 40 square meters so it's pretty big and we also use ac I pretty sure you couldn't do this in Europe because it's going to be just freaking expensive. So, but in Argentina, uh, electricity is very, very, very cheap and we can use it like 24 seven and it's still going to be cheap and we wouldn't pay too much for electricity. And also he wanted to say that everything included in our price for apartments. Yeah, that's right. And also we have here Apple TV. And oh uh, yeah, that's super cool, nice. And we have Netflix. So. Yeah, and uh, all of this it's included in price for these apartments. And uh, how much we paid for this? Yeah, this apartment cost four hundred fifty dollars. We paid for three months uh, upfront, and uh, we paid around two thousand three hundred fifty US dollars. 
uh, it was include the realtor guy, include Daria, she helped us to find this apartment. No, I'm a blogger. Uh, it also includes deposit and it's uh, returnable. It's uh, equal to uh, payment for one month, so it's also 450. And if we not broke anything in the apartment, we're gonna have our deposit back when we will check out. Bicycle. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, and it's also include bicycle. It wasn't include bicycle, but we, we told owner of this apartment, Sandra, that it's expensive for us to rent a bicycle from bicycle station because we're tourists, we don't have any documentation here. But if you are local, you rent it, or if you have any documents here, it's cheaper in a few times. And she said that if it is like that, like that, so we could take her bike, her bicycle, and so now we just take her bicycle because it's uh, here in the stairs and it's really nice. So this is pretty much all we wanted to say. And if you have budget like at least five, uh, seven hundred dollars per month, you're going to find really great apartments, but you will have to pay for three months plus commission for realtor guy plus deposit, which is going to be refundable and you're gonna pay like two, two and a half, maybe three thousand uh, dollars in one like payment but it's gonna be for like next next few months oh we wanted to say about how to find uh, a place you can use website Mercado Libre I think we're gonna have um, a link in the mm -hmm. description and you can use Facebook groups or my marketplace. One of our friend found a place to stay just because she write a um, post in a Facebook group about Buenos Aires uh, apartments or something like that. And she just said like, I'm looking for a place. And just some girl in the comments said that she have a place and it's really nice. And she didn't pay any deposit or any commission for real estate agency. Yes. Uh, so this is also a great way or you can use a marketplace on Facebook or you always can use Airbnb but that's going to be more expensive. Yeah and now we're going to go to our favorite coffee pl you wanted to say something? Uh, yeah I want to say that uh, not only Mercado Libre that uh, you could try to find something in a uh, special website also link uh, going to be in description. I wanted to say that now we're going to go to our favorite coffee place so we actually ready. Peace gonna show you the streets uh, while we go into the coffee place and prices in the coffee place yeah and don't forget to uh, follow our channel and uh, sorry for my English uh, if you follow our channel uh, it's could be it's great gonna be a great motivation for yeah, him to yeah, improve it's, his it's, English it could be great motivation for me like and for me also my yeah English is also not there. follow not there. our channel please <laughs> <laughs> Woo! This is our street. It could be great when it will be summer, but now I'm not sure that it's so cool, <laughs> you know. But we go to the right now, and the, it's our best coffee place here in our neighborhood. Yeah, and it's green, and it's middle of the winter right now. dogs and uh, look at this now we're in uh, our best coffee place in our neighborhood and they have here water bowls for dogs not only one second one my money is wiggle wiggle uh -huh. <laughs> guys uh, thank you for hi again. hi again thank you for watching this video follow to our channel it's gonna be really great motivation for us to make more video tell you more about buenos aires and improve our english yeah and sorry for our english we don't practice it really much we usually speak in russian everywhere yeah follow bye bye thank you <laughs>